how to connect Printful with TikTok Shop. Uh, this video will be a complete guide for you from designing your Printful uh, product all the way to selling it on TikTok Shop. And that involves connecting your Printful to TikTok. Okay, so uh, the most important thing, let's get this out of the way. You need to set up your TikTok Shop account. You can log in with your TikTok account, um, but uh, make sure that you are registering as a business because uh, for Printful, uh, there are some cases that the TikTok shop uh, that you have, if you register it other than a business, i.e. you're selling it as an individual, if you use Printful for that, uh, TikTok will uh, see it as a violation of their terms and services and conditions. So just uh, for the sake of safety, just uh, make sure that at this point, uh, set your TikTok uh, account as a business account. Uh, to do that, just add a TikTok Business Center account. You can also uh, find videos on how to set TikTok Business Center on the uh, videos that are uploaded on the channel. But okay, so the most important thing here is to register a TikTok shop a TikTok shop account. It's very simple. I trust you can do it yourself. Let's get into uh, Printful. Okay, for Printful, you need to set up your um, Printful account also. And uh, I think for this method, like connecting Printful to TikTok, it is most, uh, it's, it's better suited for US and UK sellers because as of now, I believe that on the step two over here, so we have four steps, right? On step two, uh, and connect your store, you can only authorize it on the US or on in the UK. But uh, without further ado, let's go to the tutorial. Okay, so the first step is to design our product, right? To, and to design our product, it's very easy. Just click start over here, especially if you just get started, this is very easy. Now, I do have a product template here, but if you haven't already, just click create new product and choose one of those, uh, one of the uh, templates over here and just follow along the tutorial on uh, Printful. It is very uh, intuitive. I trust you, you can do it yourself. Now, I already have an example product over here. This is an example product if you just started uh, Printful. For the context of this video, I believe this is uh, enough for demonstrating the connection between Printful and TikTok Shop. Now, you can download your mockup, you can make an order, or you can add to your store. Now, what we want is to add to our store because we want to sell this product to our uh, store, right? So that's how Printful works. The, you source your um, your product on Printful and Printful will connect your uh, product you made and their platform to the store that you have. And uh, this is kind of like drop shipping, but you like you're selling your own product from Printful. Like Printful is your vendor, so to say. Okay, so let's click add to store. And let's connect store. As you can see, I haven't added, I haven't set my, my store connection yet. So this is a perfect time to do so. Let's choose our platform. You can either choose my store's platform or a manual order platform. This is best if you have like your own custom website. I think this is more suited for the like enterprise um, and like the big businesses. But for uh, like people like us, I think we use one of those platforms that you see the icon in here, right? So, okay, so let's choose, let's choose platform. And you, as you can see there, there are pretty much all the major uh, stores, but what we want is the TikTok shop, right? So let's cr just scroll down and click TikTok shop and click connect. And let's run through the uh, the instructions here. Okay, so step one is to register and set up our TikTok account. So um, I have already uh, done this. I've already added a TikTok account. Now, uh, once you've registered your TikTok account, let's go to step two. Okay, so step two is to set up our warehouse. Now, this is important because the way Printful works is that when there's an order for from your store, uh, Printful will handle that, right? Now, to uh, be able to uh, 
authorize your uh, TikTok shop to Printful, you need to choose the pickup warehouse and the return warehouse um, the same as Printful's warehouse because that's where they will uh, send and receive the returned products of uh, uh, from from your Printful, right? Okay, so let's say for example here, I am going to add the uh, US Printful warehouse, which is on the North Carolina facility over here. So let's head over to TikTok shop and on TikTok shop, go to uh, shipping and go to shipping options. And let's set up the, uh, let's set up the warehouse. Let's go to, Okay, it's in the account settings. So just scroll down all the way to my account and go to account settings and you will see your warehouse settings as one of the uh, uh, tiles over here. So let's click warehouse settings. And I have my default warehouse over here, but I want to add another uh, warehouse. But as you can see, I think it's under review and I cannot add it yet. But uh, if I edit this, I think I, I believe we can do that. Now for our warehouse, uh, just uh, add the pickup and return warehouse uh, the same as uh, the the details over here, like on the North Carolina um, facility. Okay, once you've done that, uh, go ahead and go to over here. Now you can see, as you can see, you can add your uh, information right like this it's also required printful user uk and us okay on the third step is uh there you go you need to be able to use custom uh custom shipping information so if the shipped via platform option stays enabled enabled Printful won't receive the full shipping details of your orders and will be imported as a draft. So you need to manually confirm your orders on your Printful dashboard and fill in the missing ship shipping details. Now, um, unfortunately, in my case, I have an Indonesian, uh, I have an Indonesian uh, TikTok, but uh, so I will not be able to use ship uh, custom like a shipping template like in the US. So I will need to do like the manually uh, confirm the orders. But otherwise, uh, if you're in the US, you can just do all of these steps and click authorize US. But for my case, I cannot exactly do that because again, I'm not from the US or the UK. So what I can do is just, well, just uh connect automatically uh tiktok shop to printful using a third party maybe using a zapier like for example if you set up your zapier like if there's an order on tiktok shop you can automatically set an order also on printful uh using zapier but that's pretty much i think the i, th I think i only find that a uh, solution to uh, that problem but however, I'm going to show you how you can uh, go ahead and continue to the next step right here. Okay, so once we've connected the store, let's say for example, you've connected your TikTok shop store and the third step is to upload the products to store. Um, this is done easily by, if you look at the product design, you can see uh, this and just click add to store over here and it will be added to your TikTok uh, shop store. Now the last thing that I want to do and I want to show you is that how you can actually market your uh, Printful product. So firstly you need to set up your billing on Printful of course and you need to set up your billing on TikTok shop. Now the way we market our product on TikTok is of course using our uh, sellable media, right? There you go, shoppable, shoppable videos. Now, this, these are the streams of your sales. You can, now you can create sales from the shop tab, or you can create a shop ads in which the uh, the potential customer will click on your uh, video and they will be able to see the in, the built-in TikTok shop app. Uh, and you can also use uh, campaigns, uh, ad campaigns to market your products. Now for now for the bulk of our um, our 
sales will be from the the shopping videos, right? So to set this up is to just click activate shop. Now I haven't added my my shop. My shop is actually pretty brand new, so it's activated. But uh, what you want to do is to just uh, set that up and create a shoppable video. Like create a video over here. And the great thing about this is that you can just choose an array of examples over here. So let's say, for example, oh, this this template is winning over here because it has 19K uh, rating. And this is also 10.3K rating, 2.3K rating. You can see uh, a lot of templates that you can find and use your own. So let's just do one of those template. Now you need to edit on CapCut. It has set up, uh, it has to have nine clips. You It is required that you have nine clips of your product. And um, when you can, uh, when you have nine clips, you can just use this uh, template and edit on CapCut and edit your videos. And when you're done, you can upload your video here. And that's pretty much how you uh, market your uh, TikTok product on TikTok shop by using the uh, videos, right? Alternatively, you can choose highlights. Like a lot of uh, marketers use live, uh, live sessions to sell their product, right? Now the live highlight uh, is used if you uh, if you sell if it's a plan if you plan to sell your product live. And once you've done uh, adding your TikTok ads and shoppable adding your shoppable videos, you can create a campaign for them to market your product, like to advertise your product. So to do that, just go to campaign and add the campaigns over here. Now, as you can see, the technicalities behind uh, selling on TikTok is very different across countries, but this is just what applies to my country. However, if you're in on the other countries, uh, this will be pretty similar, I think, but it, it will have uh, some differences. So I hope you have a good luck and thank you.